shots of the train coming in and the train station cliche. <laughs> What's going on? Uh, ben here and me and my dad are just heading up onto the platform for Chester Road Station to take the train into Villa Park for the second city derby today. It's going to be a good one here. I've also got some behind the scenes work to be doing. So, no, that's always good. But we, we need a win today if we want to get ahead of losing the table. As we are now, but we want to get further ahead, really. So we're in the train now. Just as we cut that, we, we uh, had to get some tickets and then the train came in straight away. Yeah. Store prediction, Dad. Dad, store prediction. <laughs> Uh, 2 1. 2 1. Yeah. Okay. Obviously, a full, obviously a full house. Scorers. I'm going, I'm going with uh, Jack Greenish and yeah. Blessy. Oh, okay. So, my score prediction is going to be a 2 0 today. I don't think that Blues are going to score. It's been 10 years and they still haven't won 14 against us. What in the league that is? The one back in 27, but just really shouting that. And, um, yeah. It's going to be good. I think the score is Tammy and I'm going to say Blassie as well. Come on, the Villa boys. Home. Nothing like home. Well, I've been into much that uh, focus. Uh, nothing like a good honour, mate. We're back. That's bigger than ever. <laughs>
like, I said, like, I would have loved it if we didn't concede. But I'm pretty sure, the, I'm pretty sure most fans, most fans of any team would have preferred the, but the end turned out to be had today. Like, Blue scoring first, the Villa's getting three, three goals in about 15 minutes. Then Blues pull it back. Then Alan Orton, the Scottish captain, just scores the best goal he's ever scored in his life. Yeah, so that is 4 2 to the Villa boys. What a game this has been. We are pride of the Midlands. Blue Team Road by the pin. I'll see you again. Forest.